Hey yo, what's up everybody? Welcome to episode 100 of Phoenix to Da Vinci, guys. I wanted this episode to be the last episode of the series, but I'm afraid it's not going to happen. <laughs> <laughs> I just talked with someone who has Da Vinci Wings himself before I started recording and he said that the Da Vinci Wings became more expensive last week. According to him, the Wings are about 300 Diamond Lux right now and I personally planned them to be around 280 or 285 Diamond Lux. So I'm not really sure if I can get the Da Vinci Wings today because I don't have those Diamond Lux. But I'm going to see if we can maybe do it anyways. Um, I still haven't collected all my world locks yet so i don't know how many world locks i have but i don't think it's going to be 300 diamond locks so i really don't know anyways guys let's get right into it okay we're in game right now on my phoenix to da vinci account as you guys can see i have 278 diamond locks but last episode i spent all my gems on crime packs and i made a little shop with those so we still need to collect the world locks from that so hopefully we will hit around 290 diamond locks in this video and after emptying all the vending machines i'm going to search for someone who sells his da vinci wings but right now i first need to do a kick all because otherwise it's way too messy to empty the vending machines that's just that's just annoying man it's annoying okay here we go guys i got 13 diamond locks right now and we're going to empty all the vending machines right now here we go eight world locks another eight world locks Five world locks? I really don't remember what I put in all the vending machines. I only remembered that I bought like a shitload of crime packs. But all the crime packs are in the top layer here. So I really don't remember what I put in the bottom layer. So far we almost got two diamond locks from it. So you won't hear me complain. Here we go. Four world locks. One world lock. Ten world locks. Okay, hopefully we can hit the two diamond locks on the bottom row. Yeah, there we go. Got the two diamond lux, boy. That's awesome. Right now, I got a total of 280 diamond lux. Yeah. And I can also sell my vending machines after this. Like, this is like 40 vending machines, I believe. So that's another 200 world lux. Very nice. Okay. Three diamond lux already. This is going good so far. Okay, guys, I got a total of six diamond locks from all the vending machines. Uh, that's about what I expected. I expected to get like five diamond locks, so it's it's really good. It's good. Let's drop them with the rest of my diamond locks. Here we go. So right now, I got a total of 284 diamond locks, and I'm pretty sure that's not going to be enough. So right now, I'm breaking all my vending machines, and I'm going to sell those two. So then I will have around 286 diamond locks, and that's also not enough, I I think but we're going to try to find a seller and if we can't find someone who wants to sell their da vinci wings to us then um i guess we're going to have to invest and do one more mass produce project i really wanted this series to end at episode 100 like having it end on episode 100 is just it's fucking satisfying okay it's a nice number i i really wanted it to end on this episode but i can't help it the da vinci wings became more expensive it's like ah it's it's not fair guys it's not fair okay let's see how many vending machines i got yeah 43 i expected something like that Okay, so I'm in the world called P2 Da Vinci Villain right now. I didn't know I had this world, but a friend of mine told me I had this world and that I locked it with a diamond lock. So that's another free diamond lock for us. Yeah, very nice. Probably still not enough to buy the Da Vinci wings, but every diamond lock helps. Okay, so that brings the total to 285 diamond locks. Right now, before I'm going to sell my vending machines, I just want to go around in some worlds and look for people who have the finchy wings and maybe we will find someone who says well sure i'll sell you my da finchy wings for 285 diamond lux yeah i really don't know 
Okay, so I'm in the world called Boy GHC right now, and this is a world that a few months ago I did not know the existence of, but apparently this is a world where all the rich people go. And since I have 285 diamond locks, I'm pretty, uh, I'm pretty rich. So let's take a look if someone has the Finchy Wings. I don't see the Finchy Wings. Okay, I don't see anyone with the Finchy Wings here right now. Uh, let's take a look at the price. Okay, so according to this world, the Finchy Wings are 290 to 300 Diamond Locks right now. And this price was made yesterday, the 25th of November. So that's yesterday for me. I don't know when this video will be uploaded, so I don't know which day that is for you guys. But for me, it was yesterday. They became more expensive. I remember when this sign said they were about 270 to 280 Diamond Locks. And now it's already 300. They're really getting more expensive, guys guys does anyone have the finchy wings <laughs> yo 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 guys i just found someone here with the finchy wings holy shit okay 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 let's put off my chat only for friends uh this guy yo do you sell the finchy wings okay guys this is awesome he knows who i am uh that could be really useful are you selling the da finchy wings so i'm going to talk to this guy right now i'm going to ask him if he sells his da finchy wings okay he's saying i have big eyebrows okay dude sorry okay sorry for having big eyebrows sorry i'm born like this fuck you man i don't even want your da finchy wings yeah <laughs> okay he just gave his da finchy wings to poison okay okay so um apparently poison is the owner of the da vinci wings japanese just borrowed them from him i guess look he says yeah i bought it for 285 uh two weeks ago so they really have become more expensive because someone already offered him uh 300 diamond locks for his da vinci wings so there is no way i can buy it from him today because <laughs> i don't have more than 300 diamond locks but i'm going to thank him real quick for the information about how much they are and how much he paid and all that stuff it's really nice that he wanted to talk to me and after that we are going to have to find a way to make some more world locks everybody because i need more world locks okay so those guys were really nice to me it's always nice to find helpful people in grotopia and these guys were really helpful they were nice to me so big shout out to those guys too bad i couldn't get his da finchy wings for my uh, 285 diamond locks okay so i have to come up with an idea right now to make more diamond locks and i really don't know how i'm going to do this because i do not have enough vending machines to make a small seed pack shop i could mass produce but getting 15 diamond locks from mass producing is then you have to do like a gigantic project like making 5000 uh, science station trees something like that and that would take me another two months so i really don't know what to do right now let's go to mass help right now to look if there are any projects right now uh, that are quick and easy to do and hopefully we can make our world locks that way i'm not sure let's just take a look Okay, I really can't find anything which is quick to mass produce and easy to do, which will bring me 15 diamond locks. Like, every item here is pretty cheap. So, in order to make 15 diamond locks, I would have to fucking make 20,000 trees or something like that. And 20,000 trees is a lot of trees, guys! A lot of trees! Okay, so I really don't know what to do, to be honest with you guys. Um, I'm going to place my vending machines again in my world. What I want to do right now is to go through other vending worlds, public vending worlds and all that shit. And see if I can find good deals. If I see something which is pretty cheap, I'm going to buy it and put it for more expensive in my own shop. And that way I hope to make a few diamond locks for the next episode. And I also want you guys to comment in the comment section what I should do to get those extra diamond locks. But for now, I'm just gonna go through different vending shops and see if we can find some good deals. Yeah. Okay, right now I'm in Wicker 10, his public fan shop called Temper. But why is everything fucking expensive here? Holy shit. I'm, I'm looking for those, those cheap good deals. But everything is so expensive. Probably because this world is really famous and everyone who has a spot here thinks 
he can make extra world locks with the fact that the world is famous which i 100 completely understand because buying a spot in public fan worlds uh, like this one because this one is really popular just costs a lot of world locks and in order to make those world locks back you need to put the items that you have for sale a little bit more expensive otherwise it isn't profitable to buy a spot in a world like this so this is probably not the best world for me to look for good deals so let's go to another world Okay, I'm in another public fending world right now and someone here is selling green hair dye 4 per world lock. And I think I'm going to buy these because I sold them in my shop 3 per world lock and they sold pretty well. So I think I'm going to buy them all and sell them 3 per world lock in my own world. Okay, let's first buy 80 because I only have 20 world locks with me. Okay, let's get some more world locks. Thank you very much. And put in the 80 that I just bought. Here, 80, green hair dye, 3 items per world lock, hell yeah. And let's buy the rest too, here we go, 156 green hair dye for 39 world locks. Okay, let's see if we can find more good deals here. Holy shit, look at this guys, green hair dye, 6 per world lock, 1400, 6 per world lock. And he also sells 1200 red hair dye, 6 per world lock, and blue hair dye, 3 per world lock. So I'm not going to buy the blue hair dye, but I think I'm going to buy all the red and green hair dyes from this guy. Let's buy them all, because I'm 100% sure that I sold mine, 3 per world locks, in my red seed pack shop. And the hair dyes were the kind of items that always sold out first. So I'm going to buy them all and I guess sell them four per world lock. Let's make it a little bit more cheaper so that I can sell all. Let's see, let's put the red one in here. I'm going to sell them four per world lock. So four. Look, someone already bought a shitload. Look at this, 20 world locks. Someone already bought a shitload of green hair dyes. Three per world lock. I already made 20 world locks with this. Okay guys, I bought all the hair dyes and I've put them in the vending machines here for per world lock. I'm still not sure if I just found them crazy cheap and I'm really lucky with this. Or if I'm just selling them overpriced and I'm using my fame to get more world locks. I really don't know which is the case because it could be a possibility that I had them way too expensive in my shop. And people just bought them because they want to support me with getting the Finchy wings. So I'm kind of nervous that that might be the case. But anyways, they sold when I had them 3 per world lock. And now I can buy them 6 per world lock. So I would be dumb if I didn't buy them. Okay, that would just be stupid. Even though it might be a bit of a gamble for me, it would be stupid if I didn't do it. Okay, guys, I just came up with a great idea. The set that I always use on my main character is a rooster head and a cultist rope. So I'm going to buy a shitload of rooster heads and cultist ropes and sell them quite expensive in my world. Because that's really smart. Because people who watch my videos probably want to dress like me just for fun. And that way I could make some nice nice world locks so let's buy 200 rooster heads there we go and let's see if we can find some cheap cultist ropes here all right everybody we're going to get the first cultist rope for one world lock and i'm going to sell them two world locks each in my world and i'm going to sell the rooster heads like five per world lock so that's really nice
Okay, I bought a total of 200 rooster heads. Um, here they are. Let's put them five per world lock. Sure, five items per world lock. And I also bought four cultist robes. Let's put those at two world locks per item. There we go. Okay, guys, the episode didn't really go as I wanted it to go. I'm actually really disappointed that the Da Vinci Wings got so much more expensive while I wasn't able to make any videos for a week. But that's just a small setback on the road to our Da Vinci Wings. When you guys want to get something, you, you are going to have times when things don't go the way you want it to go. And that's alright, guys. I didn't finish the series in 100 episodes, what I really wanted to do. But that doesn't mean we're going to lose our motivation to get the Da Vinci Wings, guys. Guys, we will succeed. We will one day get those motherfucking Da Vinci wings. But for now, this is going to be it. So if you guys have any ideas how I can make more world looks on this account, leave them down in the comment section. I always read all the comments. Thank you guys for watching. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.